Da na na, da na na, da na na. Da da da. <laughs> Look at these scenes. To see it firsthand, you know, in my own dinghy, with my home just down the road, it's uh, it's it's unbelievable. You know when you're a kid and you're going to the amusement park? This is Isabel right now. <laughs> That's the story of today. Just in case you're wondering. I tell a good story, don't I? They call me the storyteller. I don't know. Good morning. Good morning. What you doing? I am just getting the tender packed full of all our snorkel gear. Mm. And we're going to go snorkeling and possibly surfing if we can find a wave as well. Oh, very exciting. Very, very exciting day. Hello. Hey. <laughs> yes, we are going to Chopu today. Going to check that out. I'm not going to surf it. Chiopu, for those who don't know, is one of the heaviest waves in the world. Um, I looked at it when I was a kid just thinking, I can't believe this thing exists. So, it's pretty quiet at the moment, the swells are down, they're coming from the wrong direction. Mm. But we'll just go and check it out anyway. It was big, like what, 10 days ago? And uh, we just pulled in. Two weeks ago on the 13th of uh, yeah. Uh, August. Yeah, so we missed that. Once, Pretty bummed that we didn't get to see it. Once in ten years swell apparently. Yeah. Apparently the last time it was bigger like that it was yeah. like 2011 and now it's 2021. Mm. It's crazy. Mm. Insane. Yes, we're just anchored here on the south side of Tahiti and it is beautiful. Actually today is the first time you could really see the mountains. Um, I'll show you in a sec but it is just beautiful. Super clear water and um, the yeah. Sun, the sun is out for the, the sun first is time out. and we're very much enjoying it. Yes. Da na na, da na na, da na na. Where's my finish? Da da da. <laughs> Oh, you want to tie that rope? Good job, baby. Yeah, nice. Killing it. Cheers. Got everything? Tahiti, for the most part, is surrounded by a massive outer reef that leaves a huge protected lagoon for yachts to anchor in. This lagoon makes for a great waterway to push our dinghies quite hard and see the whole south side of the island. With multiple passes creating all different types of waves, it really is a paradise for me being a surfer. What do I think? Oh, I think it's uh, it's breaking a little bit. Uh, Chopu is, uh, I mean, normally it's crazy when it's breaking. It's a little bit, it's breaking a little bit, but um, maybe not enough for me to go out. There's nobody out, so I'm a bit scared on my own. I'm a, a little bit of a whip that way. I don't like to surf on breaks. I don't know unless there's other people out. It's good. I like that. There's a set coming here. You can see it on the horizon. Oh. Oh. So when I was a kid, I always looked up to like pro surfers like Kelly Slater and Andy Irons and all that. And 
and I also love to see them surf this break here which is Chopu and the scenery which we're in these photos, the scenery which we're in these videos is just incredible and so to see it firsthand, you know, in my own dinghy with my home just down the road, it's, uh, it's, it's unbelievable. I'm like a kid in a candy store right now. Look at these scenes. It's incredible. I think we're getting sucked into it. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know Roger. If I Will ever figure out where the road goes Falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs. Diving near the pass always ensures close encounters with sea life. This sneaky eel caught me by surprise when swimming past. Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start The huge reef really makes for an underwater playground for the half-experienced freediver. I really want to know, really want to know If I will ever figure out where the road goes Falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down really nicely here so I'm just gonna try it out nice. and uh, then we'll go for lunch. Beautiful. Fun love. Love you. Love you. Just gonna sit here and watch Kieran surf. They're a little bit too advanced for me and they are breaking on reef. Um, I actually got a couple and we're in Toal. I don't think I filmed it um, but it was quite fun. Um, I'm still learning so I'm looking forward to when we get to Australia and there's um, a nice beach break that um, I can enjoy. But I mean this view is incredible so I'm just so lucky to just sit here and and yeah watch Kieran surf and just enjoy um, absolutely beautiful beautiful day waking up in uh, French Polynesia this morning at 6am and it is just a 
amazing. In the tour motors, it's, it's, I mean, lovely blue water, crystal clear water, uh, fish everywhere, very nice people, but there's something about the green of a place which really, I really enjoy. It's just lush, super lush, and the sun's just rising this morning, and it's, can't express myself how much I'm enjoying this place already. Hello, baby. Hello. Good morning. How was your yoga? Yeah? Feeling rejuvenated? Yes. Can you tell? Yes. You're just glowing with that rejuvenated glow. Tell me, what are we doing today? I'm not sure. We haven't, we haven't made a plan yet. I think uh, internet jobs is going to be up there. Okay. Spend a couple of hours just doing patron work and oh, yes. replying to comments on YouTube, yeah. keeping every, all these people happy. Yes. <laughs> so uh, we got to find an internet. I also want to look at Carrefour again. <laughs> of course you do. <laughs> <laughs> explain to them what Carrefour. Explain to them Carrefour. So we went to uh, the store yesterday. Uh, it's really really close from here. Um, it's just big, big supermarket. Um, we're in the European civilization again. <laughs> we haven't seen a big store like this. Uh, I think Pan Panama, but Panama didn't have such a great selection. Um, so I got like fresh herbs yesterday and tofu and um, yeah, really, really great stuff. So I'm very, very happy. Uh, I could have spent longer there. We were with our friends, so we might just go in today. Just you and me and just browse. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now after waking up, uh, we're feeling quite fresh. We're going to head into Carrefour to get some internet, uh, try and talk to you guys and our patrons as much as we can. Um, we're going to try upload a few extra content videos going up on Patreon so that will supply a bit of uh, entertainment for you guys. And... Isabel and I, we have a list. When we're in remote spots, uh, the list grows and grows of, you know, what we need, what we want, um, uh, what the boat needs. So we're gonna try and smash out a few little lists, little jobs on the list um, when we get there. And uh, yeah, pretty cruisy day today. Just kind of recovering from our our couple day sail from the tour motos. Just really chilling out. Um, we really got to take our time to recover from these sails otherwise it's just not enjoyable you know when you're running sleep deprived for days and days and days so yep that's the story of today just in case you're wondering I tell a good story don't i they call me the storyteller no they don't <laughs> so we came into this anchorage to avoid this hectic hectic wind that was meant to come through we're yet to see any of it uh, I'm not sure if we're in the shadow of Tahiti and for that reason we're not getting it or it just hasn't arrived. I don't know. I really don't know. We were scared of this wind for like a week. We were freaking out about it. We like, we got to go get protected. We got to get, you know, to Tahiti and now it's just calm, beautiful, beautiful day with no wind or rain or anything. So maybe the weatherman was lying. I'm not sure. The doohickey. Yeah, we need the doohickey. Ah, oh, the power bank doohickey. Yeah, that's the hardest doohickey to find. Am I? What's gonna happen to me? Am I gonna be injured in some way? That's a secret, isn't it? I love how, you know, when I'm not filming, you're like threatening me with all these different things and as soon as I put out the camera, you're like... I actually knew that you were filming me. So what are we doing today, young Isabel? Well, um, semi-old, Karen. Semi-old. Okay. Yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> we, uh, we're going to get internet. We already talked about this. I have. Yeah, well, yeah. you're repeating yourself. Sorry, See? sorry. Getting old. Just the memories, the memories going. I understand. Then we're going to buy some sheets and some towels. Woo! Yeah, yes. Ooh. 
<laughs> Get on in the tender, Don. Get on in it. Oh, it's a nice clean tender. It's like somebody just cleaned it this morning. Oh, oh my go, goodness. Jeez. Sexy Ralph, hey? Ralph, all the, all the tenders are going to be looking at you, darling. 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 Isabel forgot to shut a window. Oh, well, I did, did I? Yeah. <laughs> maybe, maybe with Kieran. Isabel is one of the best girlfriends in the world. She, uh, she closes all the windows, she keeps the house spotless, and sometimes I speak too much to the camera and not work hard enough with her to do the jobs that need to be done. What are those, darling? Did you need them too? What are they? Keys. Keys? What are the keys for? Ralphie. Oh yeah, we need to lock up Ralphie. I don't really go well, but like, Ralphie's not locked up. Is he safe now? Very safe. <laughs> Locking him up really allows me to relax when I go exploring or mm. whatever I've got to do. Yeah. So, very happy. Mm. Ralph's now. So, what did you do? We lift him up on shore? Yeah, him so, so actually, yesterday we came in and we left him in the water's edge, and I was a little bit nervous. This is a new place, there's a new people, I don't know anything about the crime rates here. So, just to kind of give me a bit of ease. We, we've brought him up here, we've onto solid land, we've locked him up with a chain and uh, we've taken the spark plugs out and the fuel tank off and you're pretty hard to steal right No now. one can steal him. That's right. Well, you, you did lose a dinghy before, so the yeah. track record is... Yeah. Yeah. There, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm very nervous about... I mean, this is our car. If mm. we lost this, I mean, jeez, we'd be struggling. Mm. Mm. All right, let's go enjoy now. Let's do it. <laughs> so you know when you're a kid, and you're going to the amusement park, which you haven't gone to since, I don't know, two years ago. Or maybe you've never gone to it at all. And you know, you're super excited about going to the amusement park. Like, yes, we're going to the amusement park. We're going to get on rides and it's going to be incredible. This is Isabel right now. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to the Carrefour. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to get that vegan, that vegan cheese and the, and the tofu and the... Oh, ah, oh, oh yes. Yes, true, true story. Here is the theme park with all the rides and the, oh wait, no, no. It's a supermarket. Aren't you funny, eh? <laughs> eh? And the search continues. Oh, it's a joke. Um, we went to the Carrefour shopping center We've now gone to McDonald's. Uh, we can't find a Wi-Fi. No internet. We found one at a small cafe, but it was just terrible. It's just shocking. Mm. I was able to reply to a few patrons, but other than that, can't do much. Mm. All right. So we're going to continue looking yeah. for it. We we'll continue down here. If we can't come up with anything, then we're just going to abandon it, go home. Mm. All right. Let's do it. Excited, baby? Are you excited? Is this good? Is this good? You're gonna have lots of rides today? I mean, get lots of vegan cheese? <laughs> 
shopping for towels. Ooh. Sir, yes. you're not allowed to wear this in the store. Oh, I was just testing it out, yeah. <laughs> I went to the change room, but they wouldn't have me. They wouldn't accept me with a towel. So I was... <laughs> Jesus. Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah, it's not too bad. The old towels are pretty raggedy at the moment, so... Mission successful today? Yeah, somewhat. We went to try and find Wi-Fi and I've given up on these French Polynesian islands. Mm, it's very hard. So we're just going to use the SIM card and just pay that little bit extra. Because mm, we need to. Because we have to. <laughs> Did you have a good day? I had a great day. Nice. I'm looking forward to going and checking out the surf. <laughs> Stick of shopping centers and shopping malls. Yeah, we're a bit done with that now. Mm. <laughs> wow, I'm going. Um, <laughs> it's only sweat. <laughs> we just came back to the boat now and we have shopped quite a bit. Um, just stuff we needed for our home. And um, yeah, it's been a good day. Uh, a little bit tired now. We're not, we're not used to walking around in malls and that. Um, but yeah, all in all, it's been a good day. I had a lovely lunch. Um, yeah, as Kieran said, the internet is not easy to come by here. So we're gonna pay a little bit extra to get SIM cards, but that's okay. We enjoy working on the, on the videos for you guys, so. I am going to have a shower now and maybe open up a beer and just relax, mm, so. that sounds good. <laughs> all right. So now after waking up, we are now... <laughs> okay, so uh, now wake after...